Hey guys, we're going to go over the light curve of Tabby Star that has been updated for today, September 12th, from Bruce Gary. And it looks like Tabby Star has considerably brightened in the last 24 hours and is well on its way to full recovery. And we're also going to go over the shape of the light curve of the short term dimming event and show that it looks a lot like a flip mirror profile. This is today's light curve of Tabby Star from Bruce Gary, taken in the V band. And this light curve has been adjusted to account for the long term dimming of Tabby Star. And circled in red is the current flux level. And we are now down approximately 0.7% below the long term dimming adjusted nominal flux level. Notice the sharp V shape of this current dimming event. This shape is not characteristic of a comet or a planet. But something we are very familiar with on this channel, this light curve looks very similar to the flux profile of a flip mirror as it is being actuated and rotated without pausing at the maximum light blocking position. This is uh, probably nothing, guys, but it really looks like a flip mirror flux profile. What you see here are three positions of a flip mirror with the light curve response directly below each position. When the mirror edge is parallel to the light propagation, the light is bright, and when the mirror is turned 90 degrees, you have a maximum flux blockage, and if there's no pausing at this maximum light blocking position, in other words, if it is allowed to rotate another 90 degrees, the light curve will return to its previous bright uh, flux position, tracing out a V-shaped curve as shown below. Well, anyway, um, just thought it looked very familiar to a flip mirror curve. Well, guys, we will let you go. If the flux level is back up to or close to the level that is nominal, we will not post a video for tomorrow. So take care, guys, and see you in our next video.